So a few days back, I created a video on how you can download and play PUBG PC Lite in any country outside Thailand. And everybody liked it a lot. But there was an issue. A lot of you pointed out and I noticed it too that after the 31st January update, the game was crashing after a couple of minutes and this error displayed on the screen. So this was a really big issue. But no need to worry now. As in this video, I'll show you on how you can easily fix that problem within seconds. So stay tuned and watch this video till the end. And to those of you who have been reporting me about different kind of errors like the direct x10 error or the compiler or cookie error and a few more, take a look at this video above or from the description box below. In fact, if you are a person who plays a lot of games, then make sure to check it out. As in that video, I have shown you on how you can get around 90-95% to of the common errors before even installing a game. So hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Texture1504, my name is Utsav and without wasting any further time, let's start this video. So in order to solve that problem, we need to open Proxifier app. By the way, a lot of you asked me about the difference between a VPN software and the Proxifier app. So I'll explain to you about that at the end of this video and also tell you about the benefits of using the Proxifier than any other VPN software out there. So now let's move on and see how to fix this problem. So once the app is open, we'll click on the profile button up here. And then we need to select name resolution. Then down here under the DNS processing under UDP level option, we need to select disable bypass all option rather than enable. So once done, click on OK. Now what you need to do is close this app. But if we look down at the taskbar here, we'll see that the app is still running in the background. So we'll right click on it and then click on exit. And now finally, we'll need to restart our system for it to take effect. So let me restart the system and I'll see you in a bit. So we are back again after the restart. And now it's all done. Now what a lot of people do as a mistake is that they open the Garena app first and then connect to Proxify. So that's not what you should do. You should always connect to the Proxifier app before launching the Garena app, so that from the very beginning, it detects your location to be Thailand. So let's launch the game and verify that it works. And in the meantime, let me explain to you what the difference is between a VPN software and the Proxifier app, and why you should use it. So basically, both of them do the same job, that is, change your IP address and port to that of a different country so that your location seems to be different than what it actually is. But what you cannot do with any other VPN software that you can do with Proxifier app is to manually set the IP address and port to whatever you want. So the benefit of using the Proxifier app is that you would not notice any ping related issues or lag in your gameplay if you choose the right proxy, which I've showed you on how you can do in my previous video. So if you're interested, check it out from the description box below. So in this way, Proxify enables you to game lag free on your system. I really hope that I was clear and you got the point. So this was it for today. Now let me know in the comment section below for any questions that you might have regarding this video and I'll help you fix it. Also let me know if you'd like to see the differences between the PUBG PC Lite and the Tencent Gaming Buddies emulator, because it might seem similar from the looks but it's actually pretty different. And if you like this kind of videos where you get to know about something useful tech related stuff that can be used by any common person in everyday life then please consider subscribing to my channel because I bring a lot more videos like this on a regular basis. So this was it for today and I'll see you guys in my next video.